guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a little haul for you guys this is all the stuff that i got for christmas and also things that i had bought a couple of months prior i know that this video is going up very very late but i was out of the country so i did not have a chance to film this until now so better late than never right so there is quite a few things so let's just jump right into it and like always, this is not to brag or anything. I just want to share with you guys what I got. This is in no particular order. I'm just gonna grab and go. So the first thing is this planner. It's a 2019 planner, of course, and I get really excited about planners now. I don't know. I think I'm turning into an adult. I don't I'm not sure, but it's so pretty. I really like this color and the gold foil. Um, this is actually from Walmart. It had a bunch of stickers and everything, and each week has like a little quote, which I thought was nice. I got this rose quartz roller. I've seen these like all over YouTube, and I wanted to try it out for myself. It's to help like depuff your face, and it's also supposed to make you look younger. So I thought, why not try it? And the day before we went on our trip, I picked up a few necessities and those were travel size liners. This one is from Wet n Wild. It's their felt tip liner. But then I also wanted to try out this NYX matte liquid liner. I also ended up getting an Axe Spray for women. And this one smells so nice. It's very fresh and flowery and powdery. I really like the scent. And this is all I used during my trip. I did pack a few perfumes, but I didn't even end up using those i just used this because where i went it was very sweaty and hot and this just kind of helped me feel and smell a lot fresher so this was amazing oh wow i totally forgot i even got these but <laughs> this was like months ago and i did get like random lashes a whole bunch of lashes they were all on sale so then i just went a little crazy and grabbed a few they're all different types there's like wispy thick there's a purple one i don't I also wanted to get a brow pencil for my trip. I got this e.l.f. brow pencil, and this is in the shade Taupe. I did originally have the dark brown shade, but I felt like that was too dark for me. The Taupe one was maybe just a tad bit too light, but it was, it was fine. This was pretty good for the price. I completely ran out of time before the trip. I thought I would have time to wash all of my makeup brushes. That didn't happen. So I ended up buying a few brushes. This first one is by e.l.f. and it's it says 203 on there. And it's their like angled brush with a spoolie on the end. And I thought this looked really nice too. I also ended up getting these Moda brushes by Royal and Langnickel. These came in a set and they looked so so beautiful oh my gosh they were like it's like a unicorn theme and i i just love the way they looked <laughs> they came with this holographic makeup bag which i have no clue where it is now but so pretty these were from walmart and oh my gosh they're so soft and just amazing i really really like these these next two items we actually got from academy and the first thing is this little pocket knife it opens up like this and it was pink so of course I got the pink one. And then I hadn't I haven't even opened this up yet, but this is a pepper spray. It's like the blinged out version. I mean I thought it was really pretty, you know, to use as a keychain and then bam, you know, use it as a pepper spray. Really girly, but mm, I mean if you're gonna protect yourself, do it in style, right? So this item I actually got from Sears and these are these little panda earmuffs. Are these not adorable? I probably look like a complete idiot wearing these, but I don't care. They were too cute. I also ended up getting this Michael Kors belt. It's reversible, so that was so awesome. I always wanted a reversible belt. And I really like this round emblem on the front. And I love this. It's just such a nice way to like class up a very ordinary outfit. Just wear a t-shirt and jeans and then this belt. It looks amazing. These next three items I actually did get from Walmart as well. This was all from the day like before we were about to travel, like last minute shopping. So the first item is this. Of course, I had to get Mickey. Um, it's a shirt and it comes with a jacket as well. It says the original Mickey on the arm. In our trip, we were also going to travel within our trip to another place that was actually quite chilly. And so I got this. This is also very cheap, but so warm and soft. Oh my gosh, this is the softest material ever. 
I also saw these t-shirts at Walmart and these are just very basic t-shirts. I got one in white and black as well and they're just so soft. I love this material. This next item my in-laws actually gave me as a Christmas present. Uh, they gave me this as well as another shirt which is somewhere in this pile. We'll get to eventually <laughs> but this I actually brought on my trip and wore it in one of the places that we went to and it was really nice and warm and not itchy which is wonderful i hate sweaters that are itchy I'm just gonna look and see what this bag is because i totally forgot oh okay so this is all the gifts for my sister-in-law she got us this really cool map it's like a brain map I found it really interesting i really want to put it somewhere like frame it and put it somewhere it looks so interesting lindor chocolate of course she also got us this coloring book this adult coloring book and she kind of had a theme with all the gifts and it's like because me and my husband both like to draw or at least used to when we had time so she got us like the coloring book and she also got us this um sketch diary a little paint kit this little Mickey Mouse 3D journal. Um, I'm assuming this is just for me. <laughs> she also got us coloring pencils. Let's see. <gasps> Nail art stickers. And these are like mermaid theme. So of course I love them. Oh yeah, she got a little alligator. Which I have named Louie from... Isn't it Louie? From the Princess and the Frog? The alligator? Louie? Yeah, I named him that. And then she got us this little stone and it has both of our names etched in this stone it's actually very very heavy oh i found the shirt that my in-laws got me this shirt this and that purple cardigan was what they got me for christmas one of our family friends actually gave us a little gift as well and i know that there were some other things in there but i cannot find them <laughs> i'm so sorry but this is one of the items that is so pretty it smells amazing it's peony and honeysuckle it's like potpourri inside yeah i might put this in my beauty room somewhere so my parents actually gave me this amazing pajama set i have an obsession with disney and an obsession with very soft clothing so <laughs> this is the best of both worlds they got me thumper how cute is this oh my gosh and his little tail is really fluffy and so soft this is literally the so this is softer than the walmart thing that i was talking to you about this is the softest material and the lightest material as well this is actually very very lightweight and these are the pants it has thumper all over them oh my gosh i thought this was so cute and it came with socks and it has <laughs> thumper on the top and it says disney on the bottom so i saw that in kohl's they were having this little sale on men's graphic t-shirts which i still don't understand why these are men's graphic t-shirts girls want these shirts too okay but uh these were only like eight bucks at kohl's i mainly just went for this shirt right here baddies how cute i'm obsessed with disney villains this was so adorable and i wanted it so bad so my husband got it for me but then i also saw a few other shirts <sighs> This is a Lion King one. Another Toy Stories is coming out this year as well, so I got this shirt. <laughs> I don't know, I'm such a sucker for Disney. Um, these next three items are from Costco. This first one is a turtleneck. I can't remember when we got this, but there was like a blush pink shade that I just absolutely fell in love with, but the only size available was 3XL, so fortunately I could not get it. I went to like five different Costco stores and they still didn't have it. This one was like the only one left. It's so soft. I, again, like I'm so picky when it comes to sweaters because I hate like uncomfortable clothing. I like to be comfortable at all times. And this is just so soft. It's not as soft as my pajamas, obviously, but so soft. This is probably the most comfortable sweater I've ever felt in my life. It's also like the material of it kind of sucks you in, which my husband noticed that too and uh so i love this so i sent my husband on a journey on a quest to find the blush pink version of that turtleneck but uh, like i said it was sold out everywhere in all the costcos so he ended up just getting me this it's not the same shade at all but it was pretty and i really don't have many sweaters he got me this and the same sweater in a white color but I'm still on the lookout for that perfect blush pink. Speaking of blush pink, these next three items are actually from Express. And my husband got me this blush pink. 
tank top blouse and it's actually i don't know the color looks so different on screen but it is a very nice very pale blush pink it almost looks like white on the screen i don't know why but no it's very 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 pretty and i really like the neck detail and i kind of pictured wearing this with my leather jacket i had a, a vision in my mind i also got this plaid shirt so soft and i really like the color and the pattern and then i also got this hat from express just thought it was so perfect to add just a little splash of metallic to any outfit <sighs> oh i forgot about this oh my gosh my sister actually gave me this little bracelet it has like candy canes and little ornaments and it jingles on to shoes these next two items are actually from charlotte bruce i have been on the hunt for black booties for a while i settled on these ones from charlotte bruce i actually have the army green version of these which i hauled in another haul previously but i just went ahead and settled on these because the heels are much more comfortable than a lot of the ones i had tried on previously and it was affordable so it charlotte Russe was actually having a sale like buy one get one free or something so that's why i went ahead and got this and the other shoe that i got for the buy one get one free was this pair which is so beautiful oh my gosh <gasps> The zip is on the back. This is what the front looks like. Oh my gosh, so pretty. The last few items are from Sephora. This is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Bomb Baby Mini Lip and Face Set. And it has the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter and the Gloss Bomb. I really wanted to try the Gloss Bomb and thought this was like a really great way to try it out with also like a little highlighter in there. So really excited. I haven't tried these out yet, so we'll see how it goes. I also got this Good Girl Caroline Herrera perfume. This is so beautiful. If you saw the perfume bottle before, oh my gosh, so gorgeous it's like a stiletto heel and the scent actually smells amazing as well i also got this little versace dylan blue perfume it's actually like one of the point system things this has the most gorgeous packaging it's so cute and it smells amazing and it's versace so you know and the final item oh my gosh i mean this one this one was a beyond splurge item Yes, this is the Pat McGrath Mothership Palette. Let me just take a look at this beauty. Oh my goodness. This is such a heavily weighted palette. Oh my gosh, it's just so gorgeous. Are you ready for this? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. It's so beautiful. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's it for this huge haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys got for Christmas. Did you guys get anything interesting? I would love to know down below. Other than that, please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!